right, in this video we're going to talk about another option called the low flow bypass. Um, this particular feature is very, very helpful when uh, you have um, put the potential for stoppage of flow external to the chiller. So what we're looking at here is our low flow bypass valve. This is our system pump. Now the system pump in normal running mode will draw fluid off of the tank through the pump, through this discharge line right here. And right here there's a T that we've mounted for this option. Now uh, normally fluid will go to the right out to your process. There's also another branch here that takes you back to the low flow bypass valve. Now, in the event that somebody turns off flow on this line, without this bypass, fluid will back up on the pump head, or what we call deadheading. That will cause pressure to build up here, as well as heat from friction from the impeller spinning in the fluid. That can cause damage to your pump seals. So what happens with this option here, if somebody shuts off flow, um, instead of backing up fluid in the pump head, it will automatically bypass through this valve here back into the tank. So what this does in essence is protects your system pump from damage through deadheading. 